So we're gonna do a full body workout, but mm -hmm. the most important part is like a um, diaphragmatic breathing. So okay. um, as you inhale, try not mm -hmm. to use your chest and send the air straight into your abdomen and try to fill up your abdomen with air. And then okay. as you exhale, Mm -hmm. Try to, uh, like an easy way to explain is uh, when you stop yourself to go to the bathroom. So close mm -hmm. your sphincters, lift up your pelvic floor, draw your abdomen in. Okay. So try to use this breathing through um, the whole class. If you need to stop the exercise just to practice, practice the breathing, um, okay. feel, uh, like, feel free, it's better that you uh, start with the breathing. Okay, and, thank uh, you. Other than that, uh, um, nothing. Today we're gonna uh, need a, a light set of weights. Okay. And uh, if you have it, like um, around oh, okay. the stand. Okay. I, I don't actually have those things, but that's okay. Sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, that's okay. I can um, uh, maybe improvise with like a. Um, Ooh, a t-shirt or something? <laughs> oh, you, well, you, you don't have a um, weight, you said? I've, I've got like a dumbbell. I didn't even read the description properly. I'm not sure. So, sorry, I, I didn't come prepared. Um, so... Cancer, cancer of something? Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Okay, I'll grab a can. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, okay, good. <laughs> ready to start. So when uh, you do everything you need, and then we're going to start with some stretching. Okay. And also you might need uh, like a, a chair or a couch, something yeah. like a support, uh, just in case you want to do the push-ups on uh, like uh, an incline. So oh, yes. not all the way on the floor. But okay. Do modification like uh, through the class. Okay. okay. Okay, so let's start all four. four. And let's start with cat cow. So inhale, arch your back and exhale round. So let's start practicing the breathing. Inhale as you arch, fill up your abdomen with air. And then as you exhale, close your sphincters, lift up your pelvic floor, abdomen in, and round your back. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round. Inhale, arch again. Exhale, round. Let's do two more. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round. Let's do last one. Inhale, arch. And exhale, round. Now from here, left arm goes up and bring it all the way across. Let's do it three times. Then inhale up again. Exhale, bring your left shoulder on the mat. Let's do it one more time. Inhale up. And now as you exhale down, leave your left shoulder on the mat, on the floor, and extend your right arm in front of you. Okay. And just stay and breathe. Right arm can stay on, uh, on the floor. Okay. And just breathe. Inhale, fill up your abdomen with air and exhale. Close your sphincters, lift up your pelvic floor, abdomen in. Now slowly come up and let's switch side. Right arm goes up, inhale and exhale all the way across. Again, inhale up. Exhale all the way across. Let's do last one. Inhale up and then bring your right shoulder on the mat. Extend your left arm forward. And just stay here and breathe. Now slowly come up. 
and from here, point your toes, pike your hips, downward dog, and try to bring your heels towards the uh, floor. So stretch your calves and hamstrings. Take your time, do it slow, and breathe. Now soften in your knees, walk with your arms towards your feet, and just stay here and release your arms and swing side to side. And then when you're ready, soften in your knees, roll up slowly. And rotate your shoulders back. Make big circles. And forward. And let's start. Okay, so let's start laying on one side. If you have the resistance band, feel free to put it on, but if it's too much, you can take it off anytime. And lay on your right side. You can lay all the way down, rest your head on your um, arm. And from here, inhale. And then exhale, use uh, abdomen in, use your obliques to lift up your legs and open your top leg, left leg up. Close all the way down. So inhale and then exhale, lift up both legs, open, close all the way down. If that's too much, just lift up your legs and bring it all the way down. Inhale, legs down, exhale, lift up your legs. Let's start, find your modification. And just make sure to use the breathing. Inhale, legs down. Exhale, lift up your legs. Very good. Engage your abdomen and focus on your obliques. And use the breathing. Inhale down, exhale up. Susie, lift up both legs. So, Lift up your legs, yes, and then open. Close, legs down. Okay, very good. Very, very good. Inhale up, exhale down. Very good, Susie, yes. Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and let's switch side. Now lay on your left side. And again, inhale, down, exhale, up and open. Switch side, Tara. I think they, they, they did a frozen, so switch side now. <laughs> no, no, we just started the other side, yes. <laughs> okay, inhale, down, exhale, up and open, yes. Yes. And again, use your abdomen, use your breathing, and focus on your obliques. Inhale down, exhale up and open. Very good. Lift up your legs and then open. Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now from here, um, with the resistance band, sit on your tailbone, abdomen is in. From here, resistance band uh, in, um, around your wrists. And from here, go as far back as you can. Open your arms, close, come up. Go back, open, close, come up. So make sure as you lean back, draw your abdomen in and exhale. So inhale forward and exhale as you go back. And make sure your abdomen doesn't 
pop out. So you can actually look at your abdomen, inhale as you go back, uh, 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 inhale as you go forward, and then extend as you go back and open. Again, take your time, do it as low as you need, as long as you control your breathing and your abdomen. And you don't need to go too far back as long as you feel your abdomen working and you can control it. Inhale forward, exhale back. Let's do it two more times. And last one. Okay. Now, from here, stay on your elbow. So Susie, lift up um, your hips. Actually, you can keep your, your bottom leg down or set your legs together. And from here, crunches, opposite, uh, and elbow to knee. Tara, stay, um, keep your hips down. Okay. And then uh, uh, legs together, inhale, exhale up. Inhale down, exhale up. Or you can do yeah, a standard plank. plank. So inhale down, exhale up, but don't do the crunch. Okay. Susie, yes, stay up. Inhale, open, exhale, close. Yes. And Tara, again, all legs together. Inhale and exhale, lift up your hips. Inhale down, exhale up. All straight legs, full plank. Inhale down, exhale up. Keep going. And Susie. Inhale as you extend, exhale as you bring your elbow to me. Perfect. Stay strong on your arm. Use your glute, use your obliques. Tara, inhale as you go down, exhale, close, lift up, draw in, and lift up your feet. Yes. Susie, you can uh, keep your bottom uh, leg down and lift up your hips. Last five seconds, last four, three, two, and stop. Let's switch side now. So again, Tara, inhale as you go down, exhale up, and Susie, yes. Susie, if that get to challenge, you can keep, yes, your bottom knee, uh, bottom leg down, Lift up your hips and do the same. Inhale as you extend, exhale as you bend. Very good. Stay strong on your arms, push the floor away from you. And again, abdomen in as you lift up and engage your obliques. Very good. Keep going. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now. Um, Tara. If uh, um, for a few seconds is fine, you can lay on your back. But if you don't feel comfortable, you can stay on your elbows. Mm -hmm. And uh, um, you can uh, alternate lift up one leg at a time or lift up both legs, flat and kicks. Susie, lay all the way on your back. Lower back flat down, curl up with your shoulders, lift up your legs, flat and kicks. Keep your legs. 45 degrees angle, or if you need more challenge, you can bring your legs lower. So Tara, choose your modification and let's start. Okay. Just make sure Tara, you draw your abdomen in 
If you decide to lift up your, uh, to keep your legs up high. If not, one leg at a time, bring both legs down. Yes, one at a time. So inhale as you bring the leg down. Alternate leg. Okay. Okay. And down. Lift up your right and down. Lift up your left and down. Susie, keep going. Very good. And Tara, inhale as you bring the leg down. Exhale as you bring your leg up. Susie, keep going. Very good. Lower back down. Abdomen is in. Last five seconds. Last four. Three, two, and stop. Okay. Now, all fours. And from here, Tara, inhale and exhale. Lift up your knees few inches off the uh, floor. Okay. And then inhale down. Um, Susie, same thing, but fight your hips and then bring your knees close to the floor, but don't bring it down. So pipe to hover, Susie and Tara, inhale and exhale, hover your knees. Let's start. So Susie, inhale as you bring the knees close to the floor, exhale as you pipe. Tara, inhale as you bring your knees down, exhale as you bring your knees up. Mm -hmm. And try to practice the breathing. This is usually a good exercise to practice the breathing. Stay up a few seconds and breathe out all the air. Engage your deeper abdomen muscle, your TVA. Keep going. Last five seconds. Last four, three. Two, and stop. Okay, now we do this one more time. So again, lay on your right side. If you have the resistance band, place it around your ankles. Again, lay on your right, rest your head on your arm, and from here, inhale and then exhale. Engage your abdomen, use your obliques to lift up your legs. Open, close, down. Lift up, open. Close down and let's start. Okay, very good. Take your time, use your abdomen, inhale as you go down and exhale. Close your sphincters, lift up your pelvic floor, draw your abdomen in. Last 10 seconds this side. Last five, four, three, two, and let's switch side. Now lay on your left side. And again, inhale as you go down, extend, lift up both legs, and then leave up your um, top leg. Inhale down, exhale up. And always focus on your abdomen and also on your glutes and outer thighs. Very good form, both of you. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Now let's place the resistance band, if you have it, around your wrist. If not, without is fine. Try to round your lower back, abdomen is in, and from here, lean back, open your arms, close, Inhale forward, exhale back, open, close, forward. Let's start. 
again, make sure, especially as you lean back, uh, to draw your abdomen in, don't let it pop out. Very good. Inhale forward, exhale back. Try to make a steeper with your abdomen. So round your lower back, lean back, and draw your abdomen in. The form looks good, yes. Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now again, side plank. So Tara, on your right side, you can keep your knees bent or legs straight. Side plank, inhale, exhale, push, push yourself up. Uh, Susie, uh, crunches, opposite, uh, I mean, uh, elbow to knee. If it gets too much, you can bring your top leg down and keep doing crunches. Let's start. And again, inhale to go down, exhale up, para, and Susie, inhale as you extend, exhale as you bring elbow to knee. Do I go up and down or just stay up? No, no, go up and down. So okay. then inhale as you go down, yes. exhale as you lift yourself up. Yes. And take time as you're up to really engage your abdomen, breathe out all the air. Okay. Very good, Susie. If you get too much, you can bend your bottom leg, put your knee down, but keep your hips up high. Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and let's switch side. Okay. Again, stay strong on your arm. Inhale as you go down and exhale up. And uh, Susie, inhale as you extend, exhale as you bring your elbow to knee. Very good. Very good form. So remember, as you head, close your sphincters, lift the shoulder, and draw your abdomen in. Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now again, Tara, stay on your elbows, and from here, Extend, lift up one leg. Actually, you can leave your uh, leg straight, lift up one leg at a time. And Susie, stay all the way, um, lay on, all the way on your back. Then press your lower back down, curl up with your shoulders. And from here, flutter kicks, small, small kicks. And let's start. And Susie, as uh, more as you bring your legs close to the floor, as more challenge. But just make sure you can control your abdomen. So just draw your abdomen in and lower back is flat down. And Tara, very good. Inhale and exhale as you lift up your leg. Inhale down, exhale up. Very good. Control the movement. Bring your leg down slow. Perfect. Very good. Both of you. Keep going. Last 10 seconds, Susie. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Okay. Now again, hover. Tara, inhale and exhale. Hover your knees a few inches off the floor. And Susie, Keep your knees a um, few inches of the floor. Pike and then hover. Pike and hover. Let's start. So Tara, inhale as you bring your knees down. Exhale as you bring your knees up. And Susie, inhale as you um, bring your knees close to the floor. And exhale as you find your hips. Okay. 
and use the breathing. Inhale down and exhale, close your sphincters. Lift up your pelvic floor, draw your abdomen in, and lift up the knees. Or pipe your hips. Ten more seconds. Stay strong on your arms, push the floor away from you. Don't sink in your shoulders. Very good. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Okay. Now, if you guys need to drink a sip of water, feel free. Okay. And then let's use the two set of weights. I'll just go get the cans. <laughs> yes. Actually, let's start sitting on the floor. Okay, so with the weights from here, um, Actually, Tara, if you don't want to uh, lay all the way on the floor, we're going to do blue bridge. So, or you can lay on the floor and lift up your glutes. Okay. Or you can stay on your elbows. And again, same thing, lift up your glutes. Inhale down, exhale, lift up. Uh, Susie, from here, lay all the way on your back, arms up. Upper arm are stable, so as you lift up your glutes, bend your arms, bring the weights close to your forehead and then extend glutes down. So lift up your glutes, bend your arms, extend your arms, glutes down. And Tara, if uh, uh, this is too much, stay on your uh, elbows, lift up your glutes, okay. down. So inhale and exhale, lift up your glutes. Okay. Choose your modification and let's start. Okay, perfect. Yes, for a few seconds, it's, it's totally fine. Stay on your bed. Is it okay? It's not gonna, yeah. No, nothing is gonna happen. Okay. Usually it's uh, like uh, on the like third trimester, like when you are like in advance with your pregnancy, that if you stay too long on your uh, bed, uh, the, the pressure of the baby could like block the, the, the blood flow, but Ooh. just seconds, yes. Okay. Yes, there's no harm right now to stay on your back. It's totally fine. Okay. Unless you really feel uncomfortable and then don't do it. Don't do anything that is uncomfortable. But okay. if it's just because you heard that you should not lay on your back, that's the reason. Like. It's, it's, it's not, it's why it's comfortable still, so that's good. Okay. <laughs> Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and stop. Okay. Now, Susie, right leg, stand up. Actually, alternate legs. Actually, no, let's do right leg. Uh, step forward, lounge, open your arms on the side and come up. Um, Tara, if you need uh, to hold on to something for balance, just stay low, inhale down, exhale, extend. So don't push yourself up with your foot. So go down, arms up, arms down, and extend your legs. Okay. Or you can step forward, arms up, and then push yourself up. Choose your modification, but until you like to stay here, just bend your legs and extend the spine. Left side. The left side? Yes, uh, okay. Inhale down, arms up, on the side. Okay, keep going. Is that right? Yes. Very good, Susie, keep going, remember, Susie, are you alternating uh, legs? Huh? Okay, Tara alternate legs also. So okay. right, yes. Perfect. Try to keep yes yeah, knees 90 degrees angle and upper body straight. 
That's good. Open your arms or, and push yourself up through your heel. Susie, remember, weight is on your heel, on your glute, and push back. Keep going. Last five seconds. Four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now, from here. Okay, Sarah. Now, okay, let's um, keep the weight and from here, feet are parallel. We're gonna do squat, bicep curl, up, bicep curl. So as you squat, weight is on your heels, push your glutes back, bicep, and then come up, bicep. Let's start. And here is inhale as you go down, exhale, bicep curl, inhale, and exhale all the way up. Very good. Focus on your biceps, on your glutes and your abdomen. Inhale as you go down, exhale as you come up. Very good, keep going. Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and stop. Perfect. Now, keep the weight. Step with your feet wider than hips. Toes are pointing out. And from here, arms above your head. Inhale as you go down. Exhale, come up, extend. Inhale down. Exhale, come up, extend. So keep your elbows close to your ears, so we work triceps, and keep your toes pointing out, so we work also inner thighs and glutes. Very good, inhale down, exhale up. Perfect, use the breathing, so inhale, fill up your abdomen with air, and then as you come up, exhale, close your sphincters, lift up your pelvic floor, abdomen in. 20 seconds. Last. 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Okay. Now, Um, stay on your uh, left elbow. Hold one weight in your right uh, arm. Extend your left leg, toes are pointing out. From here, bring the weight to your leg. So lift up your left leg, right arm towards your left leg. Inhale and exhale up. If with the weight is too much, just drop the weight and do the same. Inhale and exhale, lift up. Keep your left leg straight, toes pointing out. So we work abdomen, but we keep working also inner thighs. So stay on your left glute. Um, In, bend your left leg. Uh, bigger piece again, bend the left leg, is it? Okay, so right leg is bent, left leg is straight, yeah. right arm is up. Okay. Reach, like that. Perfect. Keep going. So inhale as you bring your leg down, exhale as you bring your leg up. Try to keep your leg straight, toes pointing out. Keep going, very good. Stay strong on your elbow. Last 10 seconds, this side, and then we switch. Last five, four, Three, two, and switch side. Now stay on your right elbow, bend your left leg, extend your uh, right leg, uh, and weight is in your left hand. So from here, 
Stay on your right elbow. Extend your right leg. Left arm, touch your leg. Okay. And again, inhale and exhale, lift up your leg. Perfect. Toes are pointing out. Keep going. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now we do this one more time. So again, Susie, lay all the way on your back. Keep your upper arms stable up. So as you lift up your glutes, bend your arms, and then glutes down, extend. Uh, Tara, inhale down, exhale, lift up your glutes. Inhale down, exhale, lift up your glutes. Let's start. Make sure as you bring your glutes down, roll down one vertebra at a time. And as you come up, tuck your pelvis a little, engage your glutes, and lift up your glutes. Inhale as you go down, and exhale up. Susie, keep your elbows in, very good form. Yes. And as you uh, both lift up the glute, abdomen is in. Exhale, take some time to breathe out all the air and really engage your deeper abdomen muscles as you lift up your uh, hip. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Very good. And now let's stand up again with the weight and alternate lunges. So step with your right leg forward, lift up your arms, then push yourself up, then left leg forward. Open your arms, push yourself up. Just make sure as you step forward, weight is on your front heel and on your glute and use your front heel to push yourself up. So inhale as you go down, exhale, lift up. Actually, it's for breathing. Inhale, lunge, exhale, arms up. Inhale, arms down, and exhale, push yourself up. Yes. Upper body straight. Very good. Last five seconds. Last four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now again. Now from here, squat, bicep curl, up, bicep curl. So let's start as you squat, always remember, feet are parallel, Push your glutes back, weight is on your heels, bicep curl, and then come up, bicep curl. So inhale down, bicep curl, exhale, come up, bicep curl, yes. Inhale down, bicep curl, exhale, come up, bicep curl. Keep going, inhale down, bicep, exhale up, bicep, yes, perfect. Last 10 seconds. Focus on your glutes as you squat. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Now, again, hold the weight and step with your feet wider than hips, so pointing out, arms are up, and then inhale as you go down, 
Exhale, come up, extend your arms. Keep your elbows close to your ears so you work triceps. Very good. Try to go down and up, right behind. Ears in line with your shoulders, in line with your hips. And uh, open your knees, press your knees back as you um, go down. Inhale down, exhale, close your sphincters, lift up your pelvic floor, abdomen in as you stand up. <clears throat> Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now again, we do one weight. So stay on your right elbow. Weight in your left hand, extend your right leg, toes pointing out. Bring the weight and lift up your right leg. Left arm to your right leg. Stay, uh, lean back on your right glute. Inhale and exhale as you lift up your leg. Okay. Let me see, perfect. Yes, bend your, okay, perfect. Very good. Yes, inhale down, exhale, lift up your leg. Inhale down, exhale, lift up. Last five seconds, and then we switch. Last five, four, three, two, and let's switch side. Okay, point your left toes down, inhale and exhale, lift up. Very good. Keep going. Toes are pointing out. Inhale as you bring your leg down. Exhale as you lift up. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Very good. Now let's stand up with the weight. And we're gonna do simple bicep curl and calf raise. So um, inhale down, exhale as you do the bicep curl and raise your hips. As you do that, abdomen is in and engage your uh, glutes and your thighs. So everything, inhale, exhale, squeeze your glutes, bring your abdomen in. Inhale, extend, exhale, up, bicep curl. Yes. Inhale down. Exhale up, bicep curl. Full range of motion. If you need more challenge for your arms, you can bring your elbows a little in front of your shoulders and do the same. Inhale, exhale, bicep curl. Inhale, exhale, bicep curl. Okay. And use the breathing. Inhale as you go down, fill up your abdomen with air, and then as you exhale, close your sphincters, lift up your pelvic floor, abdomen in. Let's do 10 more seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Now keep the weight. We're gonna do tricep kickback. So bend your knees, push your glutes back, back is flat. From here, bring your upper arms uh, up. So elbows in close to your rib cage. And from here, uh, extend your arms behind and uh, alternate leg extension. So right 
and left, right and left. So, and try to keep your arms over, uh, uh, above your hips, over your hips. Back is flat, weight is on your glutes. Inhale and exhale, extend your arms. Keep your upper arm stable, squeeze in between your shoulder blades. Susie, lean more forward. And try to look 45 degrees angle right under you. Okay, perfect. Very good, relax your shoulders. Inhale and exhale, extend arms and alternate legs. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. We do these two exercises again, and then we stretch. So again, bicep curl and calf raise. Inhale down, exhale up. Again, if you need more challenge, keep your elbows in front of your shoulders. Inhale, exhale, bicep curl and calf raise. Let's start. Focus on the breathing. Inhale as you extend your arms or bring your arms down. And exhale as you uh, do the bicep curl and the calf raise. And do it as low as you need to work your, on your breathing. Inhale, exhale, come up. Start from your pelvic floor, activate your pelvic floor, and then draw your abdomen in. Keep going. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Now again, last one. Tricep kickback and leg extension. So again, bend your knees, push your glutes back, back is flat, lean forward, look right uh, 45 degrees angle in front of you. And from here, as you extend your arms, alternate, extend your legs. And extend your, as you extend your legs, engage your glutes also. So inhale and exhale, extend arms and legs. Inhale, bend, exhale, extend. Keep your upper arm up and try to bring your hands over higher than your hips. Squeeze in between your shoulder blades and breathe. We are halfway, 20 more seconds. Last 10 seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and stop. Okay, now let's do a nice stretch. Drop the weights. And from here, do child pose. So feet together, knees apart, sit on your heels, extend your arms in front of you. And just stay here and breathe. Practice your breathing. You can move your hips side to side. Feel a nice stretch on your inner thighs with flexors. Now bring your arms on your left side. Right hand can go on your left hand.
Now back to center, bring your arms on your right side, left hand can go on your right hand. Now back to center. And from here, uh, bring your knees hip distance and make few circles with your hips. So bring your hips on your left, back to your hips, on your right, forward. And switch direction. Now on your right, back to your glutes, left, center. Okay, now from here, bring your knees together. Bring your uh, arms behind uh, your back and from here, tuck your pelvis. Engage your glutes and bring and lift up your glutes of uh, your heels. You should feel a stretch on your thighs. Try not to arch your back. So tuck your pelvis, abdomen is in, lift up your glutes. Okay, release the stretch. Now bring your legs in front of you. So if you need more stretch, bend your right leg and cross your left on top. If you need less stretch, keep your right leg straight, cross your left on top. Tara, maybe do this one, that's better. Susie, yes. And then right hand, hug your left knee, look over your left shoulder. Try to keep both glutes down and back is flat. Okay, now reverse the twist, keep the legs in the same position, but look over your right shoulder and the left hand, left elbow on the inside edge of your left knee. Susie, keep your legs in the same position as before. You're just twisting on the opposite side. So now look, yes, like that, perfect. And keep practicing the breathing, inhale, Fill up your abdomen with air and then exhale, close, lift up and draw in. Now let's switch. Left leg on the bottom, cross your right on top. Left hand on your right knee, look over your right shoulder and keep both glutes on the floor, back is flat. Now keep the legs in the same position. Just look over your left shoulder, right elbow on the inside edge of your right knee. Back to center. Now sit with your legs separated. Try to keep your legs straight. From here, in, inhale arms up, exhale, lean forward without running your back. Then slowly come up. Right uh, forearm on your right inner thigh, open your chest. And switch, inhale center, exhale, lean on your left side. Now 
back to center. From here, uh, find a comfortable position. If you're comfortable like this, just stay like this. Right hand, use the weight of your right hand to stretch your neck on the side, relax your left shoulder. Now look down and on the side and do the same. And switch. Now left hand, relax your right shoulder. Look in front of you now. Now look down and on the side. Okay, now make just few circles with your head. Slowly relax your shoulders. And switch direction. And now let's take a big inhale. And exhale. And we are done. Okay.